Yeah, it's pretty special for a club like us. We're really thankful that we're in it. We wasn't sure whether we would be in it. Um, the RFL have put us in, so we're really privileged, feel privileged to to be part of it. And it's just, it's great for everybody in the community that you know the local club are, are in the Challenge Cup. It's a, a big event for us. Very excited. We've got a brand spanking new clubhouse to show off as well on the BBC. Don't get much better for a group of community lads, all best mates. Challenge Cup. Let's give it a do. Yeah, it's brilliant. Uh, there's a lot of lads who've played a bit of semi-pro and whatnot who've probably had a bit of taste of you know something on on the telly or uh, a bit of you know online and all that sort of stuff. But there's a lot of lads who who want to play in front of cameras, so absolutely massive. Yeah, there's a bit of a buzz around the place. Uh, obviously, Oral's the closest club to me, and it's where my son plays, so I'm down there a lot. And you know, they, they do put a lot of hard work into it, take it really seriously. And um, yeah, it'll be a good day. I think a lot of the kids are going watching as well. Uh, so hopefully, it's a good game and they can get a win. Yeah, well, well, I just basically help out with, with you know my son's team. Uh, I'm not the coach. I just I just like helping out. Um, so, but the, the club's great. From from where the club was, you know five years ago when, when I first turned up to how they've transformed it now is is amazing. Um, the growth in how many people are playing there and how many member sizes is fantastic. We're, we're a decent team, we do well in the North West Counties Premier League. Uh, most of the lads are sort of similar ability, we've got decent players all across the park, all local lads which is a, a big thing for us as a club that, you know, for a community, the majority of the lads live locally and, you know, they, they socialise locally and I think that's a big thing for us as a club that it's it's like a good family atmosphere and all the they're all from around this area and that's that's a big massive thing for our club. Give it our best shot. We're uh, allowed to play a bit. Don't play like a conventional brand of rugby. We like getting the ball in our hand and throwing it about. We've got some quality players. You know we could probably do a good job in you know the semi-pro game, but we've got an absolute quality set here. You know we all want to play here. Uh, so yeah, hopefully we'll throw the ball about a bit and put on a bit of a spectacle for cameras. They're going to be tough, fit lads, aren't they? But, you know, I'd say we're tough, fit lads as well, so we're just going to give as good as we get, you know, and hopefully dazzle them with a bit of rugby and come away with uh, with a win. It's great, it, it gives them something. Like, a lot of the lads who were, who were playing for Oral, and, and I'm sure the Army have, have had aspirations of playing for, um, you know, Super League clubs and, and Championship clubs, and, and I've dipped the toe in a little bit. So uh, it's it's a massive game for him, and, and it showed the other night. I think it was forty six from training the other night. So the head coach has got a bit of a an headache to pick. Uh, you know, some of the Super League clubs don't have that luxury of so many players. So um, no, it's 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 great for him, and, and they deserve it because you know they've put some hard work in. It would help us, obviously. It it would put us on the map a little bit. Uh, I think it gives the lads a chance to showcase themselves because they don't very often get that. Uh, if we can if we can get through this, that'd be great. Uh, it gives lads the opportunity to play the Challenge Cup that they might not have had. Some of the younger lads, I mean, we're, we're quite a young team, so a lot of those lads want to play in the Challenge Cup, certainly want to play on the television before. So, no, it's, it's a real great opportunity for us, and we're really looking forward to this as a club. It would be, it'd just be great for, for the lads, and then off the back of that, it'll just be great for all the junior teams, just to see how good the lads have done. Uh, if we do get a, you know, a decent cup run, I think we, we all had a chat the other week, we all wanted a decent cup run, you know. Uh, you can get a couple of lucky draws and then you could get a, you know, a big draw for a club like us who's, like, like I've said, just you know, got these new facilities and sort of a new up and coming established club. It would just be amazing for us to, you know, to get a decent cup run. It'd be world class. I mean, everything, just, just this, what they're on, win or lose, it's going to be a, a, a fantastic uh, occasion for the club. Uh, it, it, it puts them on the map, people are talking about them, uh, more kids will start playing the game. Um, they're already organising the party uh, this this weekend and no, it, it'll be great, it'll be great for the club, great for the community and, and hopefully it's a, it's a fantastic day and, and they can raise some money as well for the club. Mm -hmm.